Book freight for your customers on an air, ocean, or ground carrier by following these steps in Magaya software. Come with me to find out how. Hi, I'm Franco from Magaya Customer Support. In Magaya, there are three options to create a booking. Manually, converting a quotation into a booking, or use the trips to create a booking. What is the trip schedule, you ask? This is a place to save all the frequently used flights or sailings to reserve space for your customers. Ship a full or partial container from this list to save time and to see how much space is left in a container. The air, ocean and ground trips work in a similar way, each with fields specific to that mode of transportation. In this video, I will show you how to create an ocean expert booking based on a trip. In this example, we're using the quick booking option. There's also a standard booking, which has more tabs and fields. Both are available from the actions button. Choose the one that works for you. We'll use an ocean expert trip I already created to send freight from Miami to the Bahamas every week. Let's take a quick look at the trip details. On the general tab is the trip and booking number, the carrier, and these other details about the trip, such as the departure, arrival, and the maximum weight and volume for this trip. The description tab is for clauses. On the routing tab is the service type and mode of transportation, the origin and destination ports, and the vessel information. Now let's book freight on that trip for a customer. Go to Bookings, click Add. Select the client. Notice these fields are blank. Next, I select my trip, the one from Miami to the Bahamas. And now all the details are filled in. Cool, right? Next, you have three options. You can load that container that was added in the trip, get items from a pickup order, warehouse receipt, or a warehouse location, or add a container. Let's go to the next screen. Select a clause. Click Finish. All the details are saved in the document template. You can email the document, send a link to the customer, or print it. When you're done creating a booking, you can always edit it, copy it, or cancel it. By the way, when you create bookings with a trip, you can convert that trip into a consolidation. Right-click it, and it walks you through the steps. If you want to use the same booking reference number as the shipment number, check the box. If not, leave it unchecked, and the shipment number will be set according to your document number's configuration. The system converts all the book houses into a shipment and creates the documentation for the mastering houses, including the bills of lading. How's that for creating a consolidation on the fly? When you convert a booking into another transaction, the booking status changes to close. If you create bookings manually, not in a trip, then you can create the next transaction in your workflow, such as pickup order, warehouse receipt, or a shipment. Magaya is flexible to help you with your workflow. You can also give your customer access to your trips so that they can send you booking requests via Magaya Lifetrack. Do you know Magaya has an Ocean Carriers interface with Intra to send and receive shipping instructions with Ocean Carriers? Contact Magaya to activate it for your account. Subscribe to our channel to get all our videos. Also, check out the knowledge base to help you get the most from your Magaya software. Thanks for watching.